Director, Ms. Marianne Marie, Board of Directors, SIA Management and Staff, Parents, Viewers, DA Graduates, Ladies and Gentlemen. Good afternoon and welcome to our 2020-2021 virtual graduation ceremony. On behalf of the management staff and learners of the Seychelles Institute of Agriculture and Horticulture, I, Jason William, have the honor to be your master of ceremony for this afternoon. Our graduation ceremony is adhering to all protocols from the Ministry of Health. There will be no handshake and no hugging. Today, 34 learners will graduate and will receive their certificates. We are so proud. They have completed their program of studies in the following fields. 16 learners for certificate in ornamental horticulture and landscaping, 14 learners for certificate in general agriculture, four learners for advanced certificate in general agriculture. In addition, there will be three overall best performer awards, one from each program of study that will be awarded to learners who have gone the extra mile and have given their very best towards their studies. Furthermore, there will be a graduate who will be awarded the SNYC award and another learner who will be presented with the SIA best effort. Of course, the highlight of the ceremony will be the presentation of the Outstanding Learner Award. For now, I would like to invite on stage the director of the Seychelles Institute of Agriculture and Horticulture, Ms. Marianne Marie, to deliver her speech. Ms. Marianne. Uh, board member, management and staff, viewers, parents, graduates, ladies and gentlemen, a very good afternoon to you all and welcome to the graduation ceremony of SIA 2020-2021. Dear graduates, today's graduation ceremony is a momentous occasion and a huge accomplishment for you and your parents. Years of commitment, determination, and sacrifice, especially in the new normal, have brought you to this important moment. Today, 34 learners will be graduating, of which 30 completed the apprenticeship program and four completed the advanced certificate program. This year, SIH would have had 39 graduates compared to 31 from last year. This is due to the fact that five learners opted to follow the Diploma in Sustainable Agriculture in Specialization of Agriculture. We wish them good luck in their studies. Ladies and gentlemen, the 2020-21 cohort graduating today have performed very well with a retention rate of 88.6% and a pass rate of 85%. For the E2021, SIA have accomplished the following. 
we managed to conduct five short courses in the following topics. Skill worker in agriculture, basic ornamental horticulture production, floral arrangement, basic crop production, and pesticide handling course. We managed also to sign two MOUs, one with the National Assembly and one with the Ministry of Employment and Social Affairs. To continue, we engage in the rehabilitation special programs for trainees for the vocational training center. The diploma program in sustainable agriculture with specialization in agriculture or horticulture receive provisional validation. Two lecturers receive certificate for online training in entrepreneurship offered by Yali Network International and in technology of agricultural automatic irrigation and water conservancy for developing countries sponsored by the Chinese Academy of Agricultural Mechanization Science, respectively. One of our staff is graduating today after completing the Advanced Certificate Program in General Agriculture. Additionally, in August 2021, the Institute was honored by a visit from the Ministry for Employment and Social Affairs, Mrs. Patricia Fancou, Minister for Agriculture, Climate Change and Environment, and the, Mr. Flavien Joubert, and the Minister for Education, Dr. Justin Valentin. They conducted a meeting with learners from all programs to get their impression about their prospects and challenges facing. For that, we are very thankful. Our current and future plans are as follows. The three-year three diploma in sustainable agriculture with specialization in agriculture is on offer since January this year. We are offering for the third year of the program on a part-time basis. The candidates are senior past graduates who have completed the program in Advanced Certificate General Agriculture and those who have completed the Advanced Certificate Program in General Agriculture last year. The institution is moreover exploring opportunities to establish training and educational cooperation with agricultural colleges or institutions at regional or international level. Ladies and gentlemen, food security is a growing concern for our small nation. Due to the low production of local fruits, vegetables, and meat, the government of Seychelles recognizes that food security is a prerequisite for national socioeconomic stability and growth, and also highlights priority investment for the sectors. The shortage of local human resource is a major concern for the sector because of the increase in the number of foreign workers working as field workers on farms around the island. In view of that, the Ministry of Agriculture and the Ministry of Education are working jointly to address the situation. Their first major action is to change the physical aspect of the SIH by building a new agricultural and horticultural institute equipped with its state of art with, with the state of the art training facilities. CIA will not be able to achieve its, its, its objectives without the continuing support of the individuals and organizations. Support. We have given the, pro 
sorry, CIA will not be able to achieve its objectives without the continued support of the individuals and organizations that have given the program continuous encouragement through their readiness in accepting our learners on work attachment, sponsoring the prize for the awardees, the release of staff members to undertake part-time teaching at the institution, just to name a few. We thank you all for your support. We would like to give special recognition and thanks <clears throat> to the government of Seychelles for its long-term vision and investment in the relation to the development of the, of the agricultural sector and the importance it assigned to the training of these human resources. A special thank you goes to the governing board of the institution for its continuous guidance and support. And thirdly, a good part of our success is due to the commitment and hard work of all staff members. To you all, I express my utmost appreciation. To end, we join with your parents, families, governments, sponsors, as well as friends, to wish you the very best for the future. We at SIA are proud of your achievements. Through your valued contribution, discipline, hard work, innovative ways, and commitments, the future of the sector looks bright. Always remember that hard work is the key to success. Through hard work, you will value what you have achieved. We all believe that the best preparation for tomorrow is to do your best today. I thank you all for your attention. Ladies and gentlemen, I shall now proceed with the presentation of certificates. I will call each learner per respective program of study. Graduates' names and programs will be called and will be displayed on the screen. Graduates, wherever you are following, please stand up as I call your name. For certificates in general agriculture, we have Richard André, Sarah Barra, Joshua Barra, Kelly Brasilia. Emmanuel Chongchu, Aaron Dudin, Angelica Estral, Netra Avlok, Majid Waro, Ronaldinho Joubert Denzel Laporte Livio Le Père Raj Labish and Hugues Tomkin Congratulations Dear graduates, Certificate in Ornamental Horticulture and Landscaping. Daniela Andoise, Ashley Confiance, Salima Etienne, Jamila Inode, 
Rashida Inod, Gina Gofe, Shaquille Joubert, Darius Ladous, Stevana Luca, Sean Marie, Brunel Machiot, Eric Michel, Lovan Stravens, Jean-Christophe Telemac, Eddie Valentin, and Dylan Pellissier. Congratulations to all graduates. Our last cohort, Advanced Certificates in General Agriculture. Sophie Gonzalez, Rhonda Lavish, Anthony Lozé, Ryan William. Congratulations to all graduates. That concludes the formal presentation of certificates per program. I will now move to the presentation of the hours to the best performer for each program. The performers will receive a cash prize, voucher, a shield, and a certificate. I would like the awardee to move forward as I call his or her name. The first award is the best performer for advanced certificate in general agriculture. The graduate who is about to receive the prize is someone who managed to upgrade her skills when she was offered the golden opportunity to follow the program. She took it and did her best. She will receive a shield, a certificate sponsored by SIA, cash prize by Anonym Seychelles, and also dinner for two, sponsored by Aphelia Resort and Spa. I would like to call upon Mr. Coppelo Kerapets, the head of program for advanced certificates and diploma to present the award. The award goes to Miss Rhonda Labish. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, please note that Rhonda is a staff here at SIA. Congratulations, Rhonda, and thank you, Mr. Coppelo. I will now move to the next presentation of the awards, and I would like Ms. Joanna Filoe, lecturer for the apprenticeship program, to present the award. The best performer for certificate in general agriculture is a past learner who devoted his time to his studies. He was always eager to learn more. He joined SIA two months later compared to the rest. However, he managed to outclass all the, his classmates. He will receive a shield, a certificate sponsored by SIA, cash prize sponsored by um, uh, Jeffra, and uh, Anonym Seychelles, 
and Freshway Farms. The best performer for certificate in general agriculture is awarded to Emmanuel Chongchu. Congratulations, Emmanuel, and thank you, Miss Joanna. Please remain on stage, Miss Joanna, for the next presentation. The best performer for certificate in ornamental horticulture and landscaping is a past learner who was very dedicated with her studies. She took her studies seriously, even though she went through life's challenges. She made sure that she stayed focused and that she excelled. She will receive a shield, a certificate sponsored by SIA, cash prize sponsored by Anonym Seychelles, and a voucher by West Hill Farm. The best performer for certificate in ornamental horticulture and landscaping is Sean Marie. Congratulations, Sean, and thank you, Miss Joanna. SIA Best Effort Award will go to a graduate who has put a lot of effort in his or her particular field of study. The learner worked hard to improve his or her academic grades from first year to second year. I would like to invite Mr. Jean Alcindor see a board member to do us the honor. The graduate will receive a shield and a certificate sponsored by SIA, cash prize sponsored by Anonym Seychelles, Mr. Jose Paul and Mr. Jacques Matombe. SIA best effort learner for 2020-2021 is Brunel Machot. Congratulations, Brunel, and thank you, Mr. Alcindo. I will now move to the presentation of our words to, uh, for the SNYC. It is a tradition in our graduation ceremony that the Seychelles National Youth Council sponsors the graduate for his or her determination and perseverance in overcoming various obstacles. The learner encountered difficulties with his or her studies due to social ills and other challenges. However, with support and renewed commitment, he or she completed his area of study successfully. I would like to call upon Ms. Sandra Sultan, the Head of Program for Apprenticeship, to present the award on behalf of SNYC. This year, the graduate will receive a shield and a certificate sponsored by SNYC, cash prize sponsored by Anonym Seychelles, cash prize by uh, Padayashi's uh, Enterprise, and Mr. Jacques Matombe's farm. 
Now the graduate to receive such award is Shaquille Joubert. Thank you, uh, Ms. Sandra, and congratulations to you, Shaquille. Let's put our hands together and give the graduates a round of applause. We have now reached the climax of our graduation ceremony. The presentation of the award to the most outstanding learner for 2020-2021. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the crowning of one graduate for the Outstanding Award. The criteria for the award includes the following. Average performer, good attitude, commitment and respect, involvement, participation in school life and in the community, exemplary behavior, and courtesy. The graduate to receive the prize today was an ambassador of SIA. He participated in various activities at the institution and at a community level. He was a good team player and also a motivator. The graduate was always ready to take on responsibilities even during weekends. I would like to invite the director, Ms. Marianne Marie, to do us the honor in presenting the award to the most outstanding learner of 2020-2021 cohort. The learner will receive the President's Cup, a laptop sponsored by Office of the President, higher training in the field of study, by A and HRD approved venue, a cup sponsored by Sunil Danji. Um, uh, he will also receive a shield and a certificate sponsored by SIA, cash prize sponsored by Anonym Seychelles, and dinner for two sponsored by Savoy Hotel. This award goes to Emmanuel Chang Chu. Congratulations, Emmanuel Chang Chu, and may we all give him a big round of applause. Thank you, Miss Mariana. Thank you all award winners and congratulations to you once again. Your hard work has finally paid off. Keep up the good work wherever you are. Our heartfelt thanks goes to all sponsors of the awards. The Office of the President of the Republic of Seychelles, ANHRD, 
Seychelles National Youth Center, Mr. Sunil Danji, Anonym Seychelles, Savoy, uh, Savoy Resort, Constance Ephilia Resort and Spa, Mr. Padayashi's uh, Enterprise, Jeffra's Farm, Mr. Jose Full, uh, sorry, Mr. Jose Pool, West Hill Farm, Mr. Jacques Matombe's Farm, Freshway Farm. Without you, we would not have been able to have such a ceremony. Thank you all once again. I will now call upon one graduate, Ms. Netra Avlok, to deliver her vote of thanks on behalf of all the virtual graduates of SIA. Ms. Avlok. Thank you, Mrs. William, distinguished guests, respected lecturers, CR staff, parents, the amazing class of 2021, and everyone watching this virtual graduation ceremony. Good afternoon. I am delighted to stand before you today, and I am particularly humbled by the opportunity given to share my experience with you at this graduation ceremony. Allow me to start by congratulating my batchmates of class 2021. Congratulations, my dear colleagues. You surely deserve a round of applause. We have come so far and to accomplish one of the early milestones of our lives, which is a major step we have all worked hard for. We can all agree that today's ceremony will remain one of the most memorable events. However, graduating from this institution is not an end goal. It is merely the stepping stone to what we aim in accomplishing within the working world. A path which some of us present here today will undertake, while others proceed with further studies. Despite the global pandemic, we have learned to live with the new normal, navigating new ways of learning at a distance, besides fostering meaningful relationships. Of course, it has not been easy, but life is all about growing, and one thing that this situation has shown all of us is that one way or another, we will never stop learning, and we will never stop to be challenged. It is the learning and challenges that has widened our opportunities, allowed us to gain new skills and valued attributes, change the ways we approach or see things, providing us the space to be the best in what we do and to keep delivering what is expected of us. I truly hope that all of us take this accomplishment as an example of how anything is possible when we put our minds to it. The road that lies ahead will not be easy, but we have been braced with the right tools to navigate the seas, be it rough or calm. There will be times when we might feel that we cannot go on. Remember that agility and perseverance is the key to remain focused in everything that we do. Keep believing in yourselves and keep pushing forward as the result will definitely be sweet at the end. When we will all see what our hands can contribute to the agricultural sector. I am happy that we have all made it through and we are all present here today wearing our gown, giving fist bumps, congratulating each other, portraying our enthusiasm for what we have accomplished. Let us also use this enthusiasm to obtain our future. For what we have accomplished, let us also use this enthusiasm to obtain our future goal. Whatever path we will take, keep in mind that we do play an important role for the country. It is a proven fact 
that agriculture plays a critical role in economic transformation, food security, and nutrition improvement. As they say, it is proven, therefore, our will to keep supporting other farmers in Seychelles, to further develop the local agricultural produce, to ensure the sustainability within the field. We can do this. Lastly, I would like the graduates to join me in a round of applause for the family members and faculty who helped us reach this milestone. Without your guidance, it would have not been impossible for us to stand here today as proud graduates of the year 2021. And for everyone out there, please join me and let us put our hands together in saluting our graduates. Well done, class of 2020 to 2021. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Avlock. Ladies and gentlemen, we have now come to the end of this virtual graduation ceremony. To all graduates, families, and friends, to SIA management staff, partners, stakeholders, sponsors, and other virtual guests, thank you for following us virtually. I wish you all a pleasant afternoon. Thank you.